get to the bathosphere in the rolling hills. That'll take you straight to the devil himself. And then all debts will be paid in full. Alright. Hello guys, in K78 back here with more Bioshock. In this one, we are going to go through Arcadia and then in the last one we experienced uh some heartbreak for Atlas at least. Alright, let me in. Alright, we also want the camera out in case there's enemies. Is that an arm? The Great Chain. I like this area because it's very naturey and stuff. I also turned down the volume a little bit because in my videos I noticed that they are a little much so let's get started exploring here i can't carry more ex proximity mines what so they smuggle stuff into here also that's that's a first they actually put somebody in a casket cool i can't pick up proximity mines i don't have the room for it I guess this is like part graveyard and part nature, which just makes sense. You would need a bit of nature in order to get like some uh, oxygen around here because we're underwater. Seems like some poor blighters have started seeing ghosts. Ghosts! Ryan tells me it's a side effect to this plasmid business. One poor sod's memory is getting passed on to another through genetic sampling. Leaks. Lunatics. Rebellion. And now, bleeding ghosts. Ain't life in rapture grand. Well, I am seeing ghosts. Is that why I have the plasma? I have plasma side effects or something. All right. Bryce, is somebody there? Hello? Where? Hello? Where'd you go? In the door, maybe? Hey, can you help me, man? Can you help me? Help you with what? Can I take your picture? Houdini splicer. Yeah, we're gonna see those guys in this level. Houdini splicers are vulnerable to anti-personal rounds. So I said in the in a different video that most of them are armored rounds. Actually, it was anti-personal and I couldn't read it. Yeah. Where did they go? Hello? I want to take your picture. Bud? Bud, where'd you go? Oh, well, I thought he was going to come after me, but I guess not. Well, now this is going to get crazy. Also, I think in the last one, it said that... Please tell me that was my shadow. Oh, gosh. You know, with the ne music being all crazy, it's like... You never know. They're shiny. That's a frag grenade. Uh, I, as I was saying, Ryan in the last one was saying that there... That I might be breathing my last... There was supposed to be an effect that. Uh, excuse me. Oh, I guess we don't have enough to do that. Um, that there, there was supposed to be an effect that I uh, didn't see because I stopped. Hello, for the... beautiful. Hello, bud. Can we. Where do you go? He appears, he disappears, he appears and disappears. He like, goes everywhere. I think that's what makes sense, cause he's a Houdini splicer. Hello? Hello, beautiful. Please don't travel around me like that, that's a rude. Uh, oh, you killed the splicer, me! The splicers, they're everywhere! Rude. That's so mean. I'm kind of 
mad. I was trying to explain that there was a smoke sound effect, or not sound effect, of, what do you call it? Uh, yeah. Well, this is just an effect that I missed. I'm pretty sure it doesn't time me, though. Okay, where the Surprise, hell is this guy? Get out of here, stupid splicer. Jeez. Today, Arcadia was closed off to all but paying customers. The man hires me to build a forest at the bottom of the ocean and then turns a walk in the woods into a luxury. Ryan asked, should a farmer not be able to sell his food? Is a potter not entitled to a profit from his pots? I started to argue with a man, and then I remembered who signed my checks. The only thing worse than a hypocrite is an unemployed one. Yeah, it makes sense. Who is Atlas? <laughs> Close the door. <laughs> Perfect. I need that, because I lost a lot to that guy. It was so rude of him try to kill me here. Alright. There's some more guys. A thuggish splicer. Which I actually haven't got. They're also anti-personnel. Wow, he tried to burn me. Okay. Okay, let's use that advice to my advantage and shoot you down. Get out of here. You good? I'm gonna use the regular machine gun runs now. Can I put these up? No, I can't. Of course. Alright. Setting me on fire. There's like a radio and stuff down there, so I'll have to get down there eventually. Hi, bud! A darling, uncivil, uncouth, uncultivated! Ah, the goddamn doctor! Wait, are you new? You're new. <laughs> Gotta get some pictures here. For my benefit. He also hit me. <laughs> Aw, oh, just to... Just out of reach. Ow. Alright. Did I finish this one up? I don't think I finished this one up, so let's finish it up if we can. I didn't mean to set it on fire. I meant to... Do this. Let's see here now. Do do. I like the music as well. It's 50s music, so it's like a taste, I guess. <laughs> All a matter of taste in good time. One more. There we go. Now it's my friend. Nice. Alright. We also get to hack you and make you our friend. To get a friend in me. This is a weird U-turn. Because that's coming closer. There we go. Oops. That's what I didn't mean to do. I'm gonna purchase a couple of these. Nitrogen and stuff. 
I don't have that weapon yet, so that doesn't matter. I'm using the machine gun first. Something's over there. Ooh. Sports boost. You can move and swing the wrench faster. Uh, no thanks, but I'll let the guy shoot for me while I get some pictures of this guy. Alright. And... Get this guy. Get some money. Alright. There's also a thing to hack here. Let's do that. There we go. Start it off like that. Heal station for ten dollars. Uh, I'm also trying to go into different rooms too. Let's not miss. There we go. A lot of little storage sheds. Why does it keep it keeps doing that? Because it thinks there's a thing nearby? Alright. I'm curious. What's down here? What? Aren't these stairs? No. It's just a place to hide. What is it? Oh, it's catching the enemies that I killed. Anyone in here? Hello? She didn't fit in any way. I don't care where- Hello! I think you're about to walk into that trap there. But I would like to take your picture anyways. <laughs> she just walked into the trap. Actually, do I have... I do not. That would be useful. Alright. Well, can I just jump over it? Ow. I did use the first aid. What are you talking about? <laughs> Hello? Is it because I got in here? <sighs> Alright. Ow. Alright. Where are you now? Where are you now? You're in here. I know you are. Are you in the ceiling? You're not in the ceiling. I have the voices at max, so this makes it different. Hmm. Alright, maybe she's out there. Hello? No? <sighs> Hi, bud. How are you doing? You enjoying a walk in the garden? I am too. I'm getting pictures of you. Increased damage. Also, the cannon is Where are you? a cannon. You're going. Oh, oh, yep. So that turret over there is not. <laughs> but in the end, they've got nothing to offer society. Just more mouths to feed. More mouths to feed, huh? Isn't there supposed to be more music? Am I going crazy? Maybe I am. What time is it? It's 17 minutes into this episode and I barely explored you anything. You just take what you want. This is a jungle. Are <laughs> the enemies say really funny things. I have no idea where I'm going. Yeah, now you stick us all. Just all right. They're coming. Hi, bud. This is our place. 
think the Houdini splicers can use magic. Which is why they're dangerous. For everyone's health. To be fair, I'm using a shotgun against them and that's probably not the best idea. Ooh. I'm gonna hack while you're trying to shoot me here. Invent stuff to get out of a situation like this. I hear another turret. And there's the big daddy. One of the two big daddies in this episode is probably going to be difficult in this area unless I hack all the machines, so let's probably get to that first. cool actually <laughs> he just punched that person <laughs> all right photographer's eye oh i wish i had more slots uh i'll give a look at the static discharge for right now and just keep going on this get some more stuff Little sister. Alright, we're up into that person you punched. There it is. Oh. You know what? I'll help you. You're worthless. You're nothing. We're fighting her. We're doing it. Yeah. Go what? I helped the big daddy out. What? Just because I was helping you? That is so rude. I was helping you. You shouldn't be mad at me for helping you. Alright. Oh, I've been that way. Alright. Down we go then. There's a lot of stuff down here. But we also gotta be careful because I think there's a turret somewhere down here. Hi, bud. Where are you? Right there. One more picture of you, please. Come here. Yeah. I got it. While standing still, you become invisible. Well, that's better than scrounger for right now. I need more slots is what I need. All right, time to machine gun down you. Where'd you go? Stop running like a pole! Ah. Ah. Okay, you know what? I didn't need to press the button more than once. I'm just wasting health kits at this point. If I died, though, I get to be near a health station that I just hacked. Ooh. Look at nitrogen. Ooh, this one's like I'm swimming because it's deeper. Yeah. Nice personal swimming spot. What's the Wait, where am I? Where am I now? Oh, up, 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 Uh, I need a vertical. Here we go. And we need to turn this around. Okay. Just 
to make sure that we have more health kits on hand. Great. I'm busy, I'm nauseous, and sometimes I'm even seeing things that aren't there. That's just the plasmid blues, Mary. You just need to slow down a few Bend on the splicing. Before you know it, you'll be as right as rain. Remember, a smart splicer is a happy splicer. But they just said the yeah, things yeah. were yeah. bad for well, you I because the thing. Like, why am I shorter than these? That doesn't make sense. Well, it's like harder to think and talk, but like they said that the things don't work very well if you decide to oh, shoot. If you if like that's how you're seeing the ghosts. It's because of the um thing. we have enough verticals to do this. Uh, you know what? We actually just need this one. There we go. Alright. Who's behind this door? I swore an oath to do no harm. And I mostly meant it. on everything. Where's the camera? Oh, with this wall? It should be on this wall, shouldn't it? Oh, there it is. I guess I'll have to machine gun it down. Nope. No, you don't. I'll take your film, though, to get the film back for the pictures I took of you. Rolling Hills is over yonder. And the Bathosphere Station is as well. And then straight on to Ryan. Alright, there's a gene swap. Problem is I can't leave yet, Atlas. I have to get the two little girls first. There has been tremendous pressure to regulate this plasmid business. There have been side effects, blindness, insanity, death. But what use is our ideology if it is not tested? The market does not respond like an infant, shrieking at the first sign of displeasure. The market is patient, and we must be too. Hmm. I don't know if I necessarily agree with that, but okay. Ooh, hold up. There's like a bunch of good things here. No, I just want the. Alright, now we can do this. A automatic hack tool, some armor rounds, some exploding butts, so I could do those, but I'm pretty sure I need some of the supplies for something else later, so uh let's not waste our time with that. Alright. And I'm back here again. Alright. What's in this gatherer's garden? Plasmid slot, physical tonic slot, that would help. Yeah, there's a bunch of these that I would like. I want to buy one of these. Because, um, that I could put back. Scrounger. And I want to go to the right. 
Hi, bud. <laughs> He's wondering why I'm taking photos of him, probably. Alright. Yeah, up and to the right. We'll just, like, get down. I'm gonna go down. What is here? What is that? There's another splicer, okay. Oh wait, I was down here before. I'm open. Wait, hold on. Take another picture. Up. No. Alright. I don't. Did I get him? <sighs> Quick! Right. Someone shut the door! <sighs> ah! Let's take us off. Just give it some time. That was my swimming spot. That's what happened. Also, I do have to go around again because I fell down. Andrew uh, Ryan reminds us we all make choices, but in the end, our choices make us. Wait, is this the guy I was shoot? Oh, this is the guy I was trying to shoot earlier. All right then. What's this way? That it went down there. What is this way? I meant this way. What is... I can't go this way. What about this area? On the surface, I once bought a forest. The parasites claimed that the land belonged to God and demanded that I establish a public park there. Why? So the rabble could stand slack-jawed under the canopy and pretend that it was paradise earned. And Congress moved to nationalize my forest. Ow. I burnt it to the ground. God did not plant the seeds of this Arcadia. I did. You sure did, Ryan. You sure did. I need a horizontal or a vertical. Where is one? There we go. And then a bunch of horizontals. So this one? There we go. Whoa, what's that? Get out of my fucking office! <laughs> yes. Nice. Squirt boost. No thanks. <laughs> Somehow I got more photos on him. Or maybe that was in my imagination. Imagination. I think that was my imagination. First aid. Hi bud, how are you doing? I think I'm done. You don't have a little girl with you, so you keep on moving. The minute we came here, Masha started screaming, Mama, Mama, what is that? What is that? I thought she was having some kind of seizure. And then I realized, trees, trees. Never saw one before. Thought they were monsters. Oh, Sammy. Maybe we never should have come to this place. Hmm. What are entices them to come here? Alright. Oh, this is the way I was thinking of earlier. I'm no sort of botanist, but I think Ryan has just killed Arcadia. The man's put something foul into the air. Bottom of the ocean, boy. All the oxygen comes from the trees. No trees, no oxygen. Give me a spell to think. Ryan's woman in Arcadia is an old Betty named Langford. An okay sort, but not above doing a dirty job for a dollar. If she's still kicking around, I'm sure she's gonna want to save her trees. After all, she planted the damn thing. Find the 
find Julia Langford. Alright, I think we're going to do that in the next episode. See you guys then.